Um, my name is Matt Kilbane. I'm, uh, I'm from the west side of Cleveland. Um, I went to Oberlin College where I graduated in uh, 2009. And um, I, um, I'm just living in the Cleveland area. I knew I wanted to do something um, related to education, um, but, but not in um, sort of the formalized school system. Um, I, liked, I liked tutoring and um, uh, working with adults was something new to me um, that I didn't have a lot of experience with, but um, I ended up just, just really falling in love with it. So. I get to the center um, in the morning around 10 o'clock and um, I tutor in a uh, community college class that they have here. Um, and then um, I kind of work with some students in the afternoon doing some tutoring, testing, um, sort of advising. And then I, um, the rest of the afternoon is preparing for an evening class that I teach. And the class is from 6 to 7.30. We have about um, 10 students who come fairly regularly and, um, and we're just working on fractions and percents. I've met some, some amazing people and heard some amazing stories and I'm, I'm just um, so honored that I get to be a part of uh, the journey that these people are on. It's very important that um, s some of our students realize that they are, are accomplishing a great deal um, when they come to, to get their GED and that it's not somehow um, sort of making up for, um, for past failures or, um, but, it, but it's really a, a very you know, special thing to, to commit yourself to going back to school and it's a very difficult thing and many, many, many people can't do it. And so it's, it's important to convey to our students that, that this is a big deal and that they, they should really be proud of themselves for the work they're doing. We had our first um, annual recognition ceremony for, uh, for the students in our class and um, I was driving a couple students to the ceremony we had it downtown at the Bishop Cosgrove Center. And we were, we were driving there and um, one student in my back seat who had just passed her, um, her practice GED test, so she was a graduate, and we were gonna um, outfit her in a cap and gown, and, uh, and she wasn't aware of that. So when I mentioned that she was gonna be wearing a cap and gown, she, she started to cry and she, you know, she said she had never expected to have ever um, worn a cap and gown in, in her life after graduate or after high school, after missing her high school graduation. So it was just a really um, special event that, that really uh, kind of had me taken aback. It's been a really special time, um, not only because of the, of the individual relationships you develop with, with students and the skills you learn, but also because it's, it's sort of, for me, it's, it's been a good glimpse into um, sort of nonprofit workings of, of Cleveland. And, um, and it's been, I mean, I, I, don't, I don't know if I plan on going into nonprofit um, later in life, but if I did, this would have been, been great experience to see how social service agencies interact.